everyone report this to deliver. Yo, I'm gonna deliver this to this person here. I guarantee it's a student as well. Someone's got some problems downstairs, man. Hey, there you go. What's this for anyway? Uh, what is that for? It's a medical. It's what? It's medicine. Oh, what for? What? Yeah, what was it for? What was it used it for? Face? Oh, yeah. It's face cream, is it? No, no it's just a cream. Oh, oh okay. Alright, see ya. Early in the morning. Early in the morning. What's going on the people, it's your boy Cam Topical Juice and wow, what do we have here? Return of the low IQ dons. <laughs> Some people, yeah, are so neurologically challenged at times. It makes me wonder how they actually manage to navigate this thing we call life. Because if this is the type of decisions you make in your kind of job, things like that, you're gonna struggle. A piece of advice, if you're a delivery driver, yeah? One, don't be looking at what you're delivering. And two, don't be filming it, you dunce! Oh my God! Ah, listen, let's get into this video, man. Like the video for me, hit the bell to be notified for me. Of course, press that subscribe button for me. It's Road to 50,000, help your boy get there. And of course, if you wanna support your boy's merchandise, it's in the description below. Now, first things first, I'm glad to be doing a video that's not Love Island related. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm loving Love Island this season. It is what it is, yeah? I mean, I care. I like the season. It's, it's enjoyable. It's entertaining. And I'm enjoying reviewing all the episodes, but I do want to see what else is out there in the news and there ain't really been much. But this is worth talking about because people are so... People are so dumb. Like, it just... It, bro. As you lot saw at the start of this video, this was a Deliveroo driver. So if you guys couldn't tell what was happening in the video, he was filming himself looking at a package for someone else basically he the package was um for a lady and he was filming himself opening it and giving it to her now what was in the package was a thrush cream i'm assuming you guys know what thrush is but it's basically a genital kind of infection where there's white discharge and um I think it's, is it meant to like smell a little bit? Like, no, you know, it's nothing, I don't, I think you just, you put it on, I've never had it before, but I think men can get it as well. I thought, I, growing up, I thought women could just get it, but I think men can get it as well. Apparently you just put cream on and it goes after a few days or a week or whatever, you know, whatever. It's not that, it's not that much of a big deal. He's filmed himself opening it and he said, oh, I bet this is for a student. Someone's having some problems downstairs this, this, and this, and then he actually films himself giving the package to this lady. Now, in the original film, her face isn't covered. So, right then, you've already got a breach of privacy. Do you understand? Literally filming someone who doesn't want to be filmed without their consent while, while they're taking thrush cream off your hands. Do you understand? Like, that is so dumb. I just... You know some of these people that go viral, I wonder if they watch me, I wonder if they subscribe to my channel, you know? That always goes through my head, because I'll be cussing people out, saying low IQ this, foolish clown that, and I'll be thinking, I wonder if these random civilians are actually subscribers of mine and they see themselves on my YouTube channel <laughs> getting cussed out. <laughs> Listen, if you are a subscriber of mine, what are you doing? Yeah? Why do you lot not think? It's just, it, that was never gonna... First things first, that's just not funny. Like. Respect someone's privacy in it. You get it. Like I, at my big age, I don't really find that humorous. You know, once you get older, you realize people have things with their bodies and their lives. You know, thrush. Okay, someone's got an STI. Okay, take antibiotics for a week. Okay, I don't care. For me, I'm grown. I don't. That doesn't. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a flipping child. You know where I'm gonna be? Oh, someone's got chlamydia. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Or someone's got thrush or whatever. Even though thrush ain't an STI, it's just an infection type thing. So for me, it's just a bit. It's a bit childish. The bit that I cringed at the most was the fact that he was asking her what it is. Since when was that in the parameters of a delivery driver's job to ask the customer what it is they've ordered? Bearing in mind, yeah, the package is open, so he can see what it is if he wanted to. If I'm the customer, yeah, and someone gives me a package and asks me what it is, for me, alarm bells are gonna go off in my head, and I'm actually gonna say, why would you ask me that? Do you know what it is already? Is that what you're asking? And I whip out my camera and expose him. You get me? Like, look at this driver, look. Look at this driver, I'm, I'm, I'm ordering something and he's pre my stuff. Get out of it. Yeah, anyone's there, <laughs> mug him off. But yeah, the guy's a fool, serious low IQ. Decisions like this kill me because I have to ask them and I ask myself, what were they thinking? Were you trying to be funny? Like, did you think you can get clout from this? Like, what, did you think you weren't gonna get exposed? 
what what kind of mad breach of privacy is this? Proper malpractice. Proper malpractice. Serious unprofessionalism. It's not a good look. But anyway, Deliveroo actually released a statement off the back of this. And they said, thanks for raising the incident with us. We have been aware of this since it was posted yesterday. The behavior is unacceptable and we will no longer work with this rider. We have contacted the customer to apologize and offer our support. And we have been speaking to the platforms to request the video is taken down. Now they actually responded to the original TikTok that went viral, but that was actually in the Shade Bar's comment section. So listen guys, I'm completely gobsmacked as to how people think that's acceptable. It's just proper dumb. But anyway, let me know what you think guys. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you lot tonight for the next episode of Love Island. Peace.